So, good day class. So, I am your subject teacher for today. And by the way, I am Mr. Christian J. Brunola. Um, I am 20 years old and currently studying at Cebu Technological University, Dagbantayan Campus. And getting the course in Bachelor of Secondary Education, major in Mathematics. So, how are you class? Are you okay? <laughs> How's your day? So, it's nice to hear that. So, I hope that this day is a blessed and a fruitful day for all of us. I hope that you will learn something for me and I will learn something for you and about and also for this subject. So, before we start our discussion, let us pray first. Okay? So, let us put ourselves in the Holy Presence of God as we all say in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Heavenly Father, thank you for this day. Forgive us our sins. Lord, I pray that this day is a wonderful day. May the Holy Spirit will guide us and lighten our minds to do good. And all this we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. So once again, good day class. So before we start, we're going to have a discussion. Let's uh, let's play a game, okay? So this game is called guessing game. I have a picture here, and I want you to guess what it is, or what can you say, or what have you observed about these pictures, okay? So let's start. So the first picture. What is this? Guess what it is. So. The animals. This uh, this picture is animals. So the second picture. Okay, very good. A group of people. Okay, so next the third picture. The crayons. Okay, very good. Or crayons or colors. Okay, so next. Hmm, part of the kitchen. Kitchen utensils. Very good. So, the last one. What it is? Guess. Okay. A groupings. So, very good. So, give yourselves a round of applause. Okay. So, thank you. So, class. What have you observed about these pictures? Hmm? Cow. A group? Okay, very good. You? A batch? Okay, so that's a nice. So, class, do you have any idea what is our topic for today? Hmm? Anyone? You? Groupings? <laughs> okay, so our topic for today is all about set. So, class, what is set? Hmm? What is set? What is a set? Anyone? Okay. So, a set is a well-defined group of objects called elements that shares a common characteristics okay so this is a uh, this is the set Okay, so read it again. What is a set? So a set is a well-defined group of objects called elements that share a common characteristics. And these objects are called elements of the set. This picture. These pictures are called elements of the set. So the set are named using capital letters. So this is how we are going to write the set 
or how to group okay so this um so for example a set of vowels okay so to determine that our set is vowels we are going to use the letter the capital v the letter v start from the word vowels okay so we're going to use the letter v as the capital letters so next the inside the set are the lower cases letters it to denotes elements of the set so what are the vowels so we have a e i o u so this our this is our this is our vowels so the next one it denotes of the list of elements in a set it's called ano, curly braces so this this is a curly braces it denotes the list of elements of the set in the set okay get it so another example so we have a primary colors so what are the primary colors we have red blue yellow so this we use the, the capital letter C as to determine that our set is colors so the primary colors are red blue yellow so this is our set so now we are going to discuss the type of the set so what are these what are the types of sets who can guess okay so the types of a set are the will defined and not will defined so what is will defined anyone okay very good So, well-defined set is a set that will define collection of distinct objects. Okay. A set that will define collection of distinct objects or it can be easily determine so for example we have a set of animals having a four legs okay a set of animals with four legs so what are these so we have cow horse goat and cut so this is the example of will define set cow horse goat cat okay so next example a set of odd numbers from 1 to 20 so what are our odd numbers we have 1 3 3, 5, 7, 9, 11, 13, 15, 17, and 19. So these sets are easily to determine the object. Okay? So this is our, this is the well-defined set. So questions? Okay, none so far. So now we are going to discuss the not well defined set. So, what is not well defined set? Anyone? So, not well defined set are the set which do not have distinct elements 
So like for example, um, a set of writers. So why this set is not well defined? Because we cannot determine easily who are the writers. So another example, um, a set of smart students. Okay. A set of smart students. So we cannot determine easily who are the smart students. Okay. This set is do not have distinct elements. So another another example, um, a set of handsome in B is in math to B. So in that set, we cannot determine easily because that set is do not have distinct elements. For example, um, he is handsome. For me, he is a handsome, but the others are saying that he is not. Right? So there's no distinct elements in that set. So that is not well defined set. Okay, any questions regarding our topic? Okay, so because it's none so far, so we're we're going to have an assessment. Okay? So kindly answer this following and determine whether the set is well defined set or not well defined set so get a sheet of paper paper and copy and answer okay Okay, so let's check your work. Kindly exchange your paper into your seatmates. Okay? Okay, so number one. A set of painting materials. It is well-defined set or not well-defined set? Okay, very good. Well-defined set. Okay, number two. A set of animals having two legs. Is it well-defined set or not well-defined set? Very good. Well defined set. Number three, a subject of grade seven students. Well defined set or not well defined set? Okay, very good. Well defined set. Number four, a set of days in a week. Very good. Well defined set. So, number five, sit, set of writers. Okay, very good. Not well defined set because we cannot determine who are the writers. Right? Okay, number seven. Or number six, rather. Set of five best players of football. Is it well defined set or not? Okay, very good. Not well defined set. So number eight, as rather, number seven, a set of students in a classroom. 
Is it well-defined set or not well-defined set? Okay, well-defined well set. Okay, very good. Number eight, a, a set of active teachers in grade eight. Grade eight. Is it well-defined or not well-defined? Okay, very good. A not well-defined set. Number nine, a set of barangays in municipality of the Anbantayan. Well-defined set. Very good. So, number ten, the last number, a set of best destinations. Very good. Not well-defined set. Okay, so, who got the perfect score? <laughs> okay, very good. So, clap, clap yourself, give yourself a hundred claps. So class, thank you so much for being here. <laughs> thank you for listening. I hope that you you have learned about the set. Okay? So thank you for the time. Thank you so much. So God bless and have a nice day.